number 11, we're asked to find the domain of the function. Um, when we discuss domains, especially with even roots, the square root of x squared minus x minus 6, we do not want to take the square root of negative. Otherwise, it'll be a complex solution or complex answers. And when they refer to these questions, we want to make sure that we come up with real solutions. So we don't want those. So we want x squared minus x minus 6 to be greater than or equal to 0. It can equal 0, but it just can't be less than so. That's when x, go ahead and factor it, minus 3 plus 2 is greater than or equal to 0. So now using that same concept that we were using on the previous problem, number 10, we know it's equal to 0 to negative 2, and at a positive 3, we have a smiling quadratic equation. So it's equal to 0, equal to 0. We want to make sure that we only use values that are going to give us positives. So that's from negative infinity to a negative 2 union that with 3 to infinity.